Hello friends, welcome to Penos.in. In this video, we are going to see a short review on Star 1 Millennium Full Silver Fountain Pen with Green Grip. And this video is specifically taken to give you the clear insights on the pen because just with photos, you cannot fully understand about this. The brand's name Star 1 is mentioned in this cap portion and there is a golden color clip and arrow type 1. A very sturdy one and as this is a metal pen you can engrave your names on the cap or on the body of this pen and this is a very thin green color grip a plastic one and this is number 5.5 nib which has a fine tip silver plated one and in this nib it is mentioned as Hari Hunt Iridium Point Hari Hunt Brands nib and you can swap the nibs as you like since we have number 5.5 nibs in many brands and usually pen enthusiasts will swap with candid nibs where we have a fine medium broad and again with gold white and silver plated nibs and also flex nibs can be swapped in this pen in number 5.5 and so the choice is yours for that you can go to our site click pen spares then go to nibs and there you can use a filter and make a query on what you require now the measurements the holding area's diameter is 8.8 .8 mm and the body's diameter is 11 mm and the length of this pen without cap is 122.0 or 122 mm and with cap it is 134.5 mm with this measurement you can get some idea about the pouches for this pen if you maintain this using a pouches and all the same aesthetic same shininess will last forever and yeah now to the weight of this pen the entire weight of this pen is 18 grams and there is a golden design a golden ring on the top of this grip portion and here this is a cartridge converter type ink filling system in converter you have to move this forward and dip in the ink and pull this back so ink will be filled up this portion otherwise you can use cartridges also and a very safe place for this cartridge uh, a converter then you can also do this with the uh, without fixing it you can do this also like this on pen maintenance please wash the pens regularly that is twice a month because all the dye based ink will precipitate on the long usage so it will block the ink's passage in the feeder so you will get a scratchy writing and slowly the ink will dry quickly and then you may have to shake the pens for the ink flow to come out the reason is the blockage in the feeders grow so to clean the dirts and deposits in the feeder please remove the feeder and the nib unit separately by holding this together and twist and pull it out and after removing you can flush the feeder with the help of any brush or clean it well with soap water if you are soaking in soap water then allow it for an hour and brush and clean in some ink bottles itself you can notice on every fill it is recommended to clean the pen with water so it is clear unless otherwise we have good cleaning and maintenance the flow will be affected and few nibs need to be fine tuned because during the manual assembly of nibs the tines may stick together so gently push the tines up and down so it will create some space in between the tines and you will get a smooth writing and a very good ink flow in tone and whenever we dispatch the pen we do this fine tuning and we will check before dispatch this is our usual practice and let me give the writing sample of this pen with our penthouse emerald green ink
a very fine smooth writing yeah a very smooth writing And if you have any query about this pin, you can ask in the comment section or else you can make a call to our mobile number. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.